Here is an Arillic up to stream Pro version 3 board. Not a sponsored video, I bought this with my own money, second hand off eBay. And this is how you connect a rotary encoder for controlling the volume. Arillic are happy to sell you an extension board with a rotary encoder, but I found it's very easy to do, and you may already have all of the parts required in your parts bin. The connector you're interested in is this one right here, 4-pin. On the bottom it is labeled GPIO2, GPIO1, ground, and 3.3 volts, as I have drawn up here. The connector you need is just a standard one. These are quite common. 2 millimeter pin pitch. And you may even get away with just soldering some wires straight onto the board on the bottom. But I happen to have this piece of cable with a suitable connector in my parts bin. Likewise, I have plenty of rotary encoders in my parts bin. And with these, the three pin versions, it always seems to be the same pin out. The center goes to ground, and then the two outer connections go to GPIO 2 and 1. And that's all it takes. Now, if you find that the rotary encoder is going in the wrong direction, you can uh, just simply swap the connections to GPIO 1 and 2 around to reverse the direction of the rotary encoder. And that's it. Quite easy to do. Hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching.